Our next speaker will be Mr. Wong Jun Min. And he is a consultant for the Secretary of Seoul Initiative Network on Green Growth International Policy Research Center. Mr. Wong, please. I'm Zhang Minu from the Secretary of Seoul Initiative Network on Green Growth. And first of all, uh, thank you for inviting me to have this privilege uh, making presentation in front of distinguished participants. Uh, I'd like to briefly introduce about Seoul Initiative Network on Green Growth. My presentation will focus on these following three parts. Uh, firstly, Seoul Initiative on Green Growth, and secondly, Key Activity of Seoul Initiative, and lastly, new focus for year 2009 to year 2010. Seoul Initiative on Green Growth is one of the major outcomes of the 5th Ministerial Conference on Environment and Development, in short, UNMCED, which was held in year 2005 in Seoul, hosted by UNESCO. At MCED, many ministers from Asia and the Pacific region who are in charge of the environment or development gather together and discuss what the environment and development strategy in the Asia Pacific region would be. At the fifth MCED, the Minister from Korea has suggested the Seoul Initiative on Green Growth as a priority implementation plan in Asia Pacific region. The agenda was fully adopted by the Minister at the conference. And there are three target areas of Seoul Initiative on Green Growth. First target is improving eco efficiency for environmental sustainability. It means we have to concern how to maximize growth of opportunity with minimum damage on environmental sustainability. Second target is enhancing environmental performance. Last one is promoting environment as an opportunity for economic growth and development <coughs> that is, how to utilize environment as an opportunity for economic growth Here is Seoul Initiative Network on Green Growth In short, you can call it SINGG, SING SING is the implementation mechanism of Seoul Initiative to provide a regional cooperative framework for great green growth with 47 member countries participating in the scene. Korean Minister of Environment is a primary financial contributor for the scene with in-kind support from relevant institutions like Emico. Emico is my company. Emico Korea Environment and Resources Corporation is the Secretary of Seoul Initiative Network on Green Growth. 
and SYNC has four priority activity and I will explain this with next slide. Yes, this slide shows the structure of the SYNC activity. The first activity is knowledge sharing and advocating activity through policy consultation forum in every year since year 2006. And secondly, for the capacity building, we invite governmental official or expert from SI member, sole initiative member country and train them with green growth concept. And the result of this activity needs to be translated into an action, that is implementation of pilot project. We call for proposal of the project from the SI member country and review the proposal and select the project and implement in the SI member country. Uh, we have implemented three pilot projects in year 2008 and in this year we are implementing two pilot projects, uh, four pilot projects are implementing. So every two years, we have a site network meeting to review the activity of the scene and set the direction way forward. In next year, next MCED will be held in Kazakhstan. At the MCED, the achievement of the scene will be supposed to report. Four priority activity of the things are shown in this slide as I told in previous slide. With this uh, pilot cons uh, policy consultation forum and leadership program and pilot project and networking, we hope to well reach it, well reach it to the green growth in the Asia and Pacific region. And this slide shows implementing organization. Uh, UNSCAR is the uh, main organizer of activity. It developed agenda for the forum and leadership program. And Korea Ministry of Environment is yearly funding for networking network activity organized by UNSCAR and NBCO. National Institute of Environmental Human Resources Development, in short EHRD, is in charge of SI leadership program with technical support from SIN Secretariat and UNSCAR. And EMICO has served as the Secretary of Seoul Initiative Network on Green Cross. From this slide, I'd like to show you the key activity of Seoul Initiative so far. Um, we set a theme of activity every year and under that theme um, implement policy consultation forum, leadership program, pilot project and so on. So you can see the theme from year 2006 and second is year 2007 and year 2008 and year 2009. And you can see that uh, this slide is the number of the participants to the forum. And this slide shows the number of participants of the capacity building program. The capacity building program has this kind of activity such as workshop, group discussion, presentation of country report, case studies, and field trip, and so on. And this is about pilot project which were conducted in year 2008. Two pilot projects were in Vietnam and one project was in Cambodia. 
and this is an article about Vietnamese pilot project. And this slide is about this year's pilot project in Bangladesh and Laos and China and Indonesia. We also operate a website of the same. So the website, the address of the website is www.singg.org. So if you visit the website, you can see all the activity of the same. Through the activity of the scene, we have achieved many valuable things including emerging policy options, networking for green growth, and green growth approaches through the pilot project. Uh, through the activity of the scene, we have found potential of the scene as following. Well-established implementation mechanism, strong network foundation to pursue green growth, in the region, and strong commitment of Korean Ministry of Environment and its affiliated organization for supporting the scene. <coughs> Lastly, I will explain our focus in year 2009 to year 2010. Up to year 2008, we have focused on disseminating the concept of green growth, but from this year, we have started to focus on translating green growth into action. So our major concern is how green growth can be applied to. To achieve that, we found the efficient way to apply the green growth concept in the region. It is to implement pilot project as follows. Uh, from October to November, we go for the proposal, and in December, uh, we review them. And then we select the project among the collected proposal and implement them. Therefore, um, you can also apply the pilot project in that period. So your application will be more than welcome. This is the end of my presentation, and thank you for your attention. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Wu. Please have a seat, please. So, we are very pleased that Mr. Wu update us the progress of Green in the Seoul Initiative Network on Green Growth. Um,